Hello, my name is Lucius. Today I'm going to explain quickly how cable car works with 3D animation. Cable car or aerial tramway or ropeway, whichever you like to call it. Cable cars have no engine or motor on the cars themselves. The cars tightly grip to the cable and the cable runs by a giant wheel called the drive bull wheel. It is also a primary brake system for emergency stop. The other wheel on the other end is called the returning bull wheel. Cable car system has two stations at the two ends, and in between are pylons. The pylons are the support structure for the cable. There are two types of grip installation on the cable car system, fixed grip and detachable grip. Fixed grip is permanently clamped to the cable and turns together at the bull wheel turns. Detachable grips are able to detach a car from the cable. This enables a lower speed in the station and makes boarding and deboarding more comfortable for the passengers. Let's take a closer look at how a detachable grip works. Detachable grip is designed like a lever with two compression springs. When this lever is compressed down, the grip opens. When the compression is released, the compression spring push the lever up and make it clamped to the cable again. When the car approaches a station, the grip will be guided to its own rails. The top rails curve downward. When the grip goes in, the lever will be compressed and then release the grip from the cable. When the grip is detached, this roller on top will move the grip and the car to a slow turnaround so the passenger can have more time to exit and the next passengers can board. When the car is about to exit the station, the same mechanism is applied to make the grip clamp to the cable again. The grip is made for easy passing through the pylons, either passing on the top of the supporting wheels or underneath. That's pretty much how cable car works. Thank you for watching. If you like this video, subscribe to my channel. My name is Lucius and I'll see you in the next video.